was, uh, I mean, I think Swoo's probably the best coach team in the league. Uh, Nick does an unbelievable job. I mean, after losing multiple guys and the way he gets those guys to execute and play so hard, I mean, he's he's a great coach and their guys, I mean, they're they're good. Play the fight, play as hard as anybody in the league, and I mean, they. It's just that was a great college basketball game. Obviously, someone had to win, but I mean, I'm just every time we play Swoo, I'm more and more impressed by what Coach Pasqua does and what those guys do. So, inside, you guys had the advantage, both rebounding and points in the paint. Kind of take us through that matchup. Why was that in your favor today? That's kind of, you know, the, the rebounds is kind of our identity. It's kind of what we do. And, you know, we try to emphasize points in the paint. Um, we did not do a great job in the first half. Well, I will say that. We did whenever we didn't turn it over. Uh, had too many turnovers in the first half. But we knew the, the way that SWU plays defense and how hard they defend the ball and how great their help side is, we knew if there was any way for us a chance to get back in the game, we had to continue to get the ball in the paint. Usually if we get the ball in the paint, whether it's a missed shot or whatever the case may be, at least it gives us a chance to rebound it. Um, so, and we weren't hitting threes very well, so we knew we had to continue to attack the paint, attack the paint. So it simplified our offensive scheme. We just kind of got down to give Tyrell Kirk the ball and let Spencer ball screen, just let them be good basketball players. And It's not coaching, it's just having good basketball players on the team. What was your message to the team at halftime? Struggling to score, uh, going into the break, down big. I, I was happy with our defense. Um, you know, it was an unbelievable um, offensive team, how they execute, how hard they cut, and all their reads. And we held them to, uh, you know, 38% in the first half, and that's that's great. Um, you know, obviously, rebound margin wasn't what we wanted. I think we were only plus three. We only had three offensive rebounds, uh, which isn't our brand of basketball. Uh, but we just had too many turnovers. They were just doing such a great job being physical on the ball. It took a while for us to adjust how the officials were calling calls. Um, and once I thought we made that adjustment, I thought our aggressiveness was kind of more in our favor. Um, and I thought it helped us down the stretch be able to, to find a way to win. Tyrell, you guys are down 15 with 12 to play, and everything changed. You guys went on a 20-4 to four run. What, what switched for you guys in that moment? Um, we just had to lock in on defense. Um, the coach came to have time, said that we were playing good defense, but we just had to trust each other and get the ball to the paint and get some um, – and make some shots happen and get to the line. That's how it happens. And then you get to the end of the game. It's a tight game uh, going back and forth. Just kind of walk us through those final moments. Uh, those final moments, um, he was like, he, uh, coach was like, uh, get a ball, to real, uh, ball screen. Try to, get to, try to get to the line. So that's what happened. Good deal. Well, congratulations, guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you.